Hi, this is Virgo the Oracle, and I'm here to do a reading for the sign of Virgo. Hey, Virgo, how are you? Let's do another read for Virgo. Sun, moon, and rising. Spirit, come through. Can I please have some messages for Virgo? What messages do you have for Virgo, Spirit? Come through for Virgo. Sun, moon, and rising. Can I please have some messages for Virgo? What messages do you have for Virgo? Someone in Virgo. Mm -hmm. Let's tap into the energy of Virgo. Virgo. Mm -hmm. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. I would love to have you. Thank you for riding with me. Thank you for all your beautiful donations. Thank you for all your beautiful comments. Thank you for helping my channel grow. Thank you. Let's see what you got, Virgo. Let's see if the energy have changed or if it stayed the same. How about that? Mm -hmm. First position you have for Virgo. Mm. We have the Eight of Swords. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have the Three of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have the Star. Okay. Mm -hmm. We have the King of Swords. Mm hmm. Okay, we got the Five of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have the Fool card. Mm -hmm. We have the Three of Wands. We have the Justice. Okay. We have the Ace of Swords. Okay, we got the Hierophant. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We have the Five of Cups in reverse. Okay. Mm hmm. And we have the Queen of Pentacles. All right. Uh, give me a minute. Let me look this over. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Spirit come through. What is this saying? Okay. Uh huh. Spirit come through. Mm hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh huh. Ready to. Okay. Let's see what we got here. What we got here, Virgo? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. What do we have here? We got one, two, mm -hmm, three, four. We'll take it, okay? Four major commas. And at the bottom of the deck, you have the King of Wands. Uh, Virgo, you got somebody who, uh, who's very passionate over you, who has a great deal of passion towards you. This person is ready to take action. This person is ready to finally take back some control and take action here, okay? Mm -hmm. Because they can't stop thinking about you. This person values you very much. You could be the mother of their child, or they just could have a, a great deal of respect for you, okay? This person highly respects for you. They know your worth, okay? Mm -hmm. This person is coming to take action towards you. You're the empress energy just you're you're the one who makes them want to be a better person okay you could be dealing with a fire sign here virgo sagittarius leo or aries mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah this person has a lot of um respect for you this person puts you on a high pedestal okay yeah you make this person extremely nervous too mm -hmm. this person might be leaving to be happy maybe leaving an unhealthy situation to come to you to be happy okay yeah this person might have to get their finances together okay with this ten of pentacles because they're damn sure coming to offer you some sort of commitment okay you got a commitment coming in virgo somebody is definitely moving towards you uh-huh mm -hmm. yeah surprise somebody has to leave a situation that they're not happy and somebody's constantly thinking about you and they value you mm, look at that virgo this, this this energy keeps coming out for you you got somebody that's coming back for you. you got somebody that's interested in you you got somebody that's very nostalgic over you somebody's thinking about you heavy virgo mm -hmm. with this eight of swords in first position you guys are doing a lot of stress and a lot of worry you feel stuck somewhere you feel stuck or trapped in a situation that you can't get out of it looks like you feel stuck at work
Are you stuck in a job, a, a dead end job or something like that? Okay. Mm -hmm. You feel stuck because you need a job. Some fuck shit like that. Okay. Uh huh. You're not stuck. Take the blindfolds off. Okay. This is on. This is your own energy that you're feeling. You're not stuck. Take the blindfolds off. Okay. The bird is not in a cage. You're not in a cage. Okay. Uh huh. You don't have to stay in a dead end rela uh, relationship. Mm relationship you don't have okay maybe relationship too you don't have to stay in a dead end job okay you don't have to feel like your life is at a dead end because you don't have the job that you want you don't have to stay in a dead end relationship because you feel that's not working however you look at it okay this is what you put in yourself and this is self-imposed energy okay that's what the eight of swords is you you're telling yourself this negative talk you're doing this to yourself okay and for many of you this is surrounding work this is around surrounding a job some of you have or at a job that that really stretches tr stressing is stressing the hell out you okay you're not too sure about it you're not it's just not kosher the energy is not well okay you have to fight very hard to stay there in peace or something like that keep taking your spiritual baths keep protecting yourself do whatever you have to do okay because i see that you're not losing hope here you're holding on to hope you're praying and your prayers will be answered okay wish fulfillment you're going to get the outcome you want you're going to get the uh conclusion that you want or um the uh the resolution that you want when it comes to this particular job okay virgo yeah it looks like you got communication coming in somebody wants to talk to you king of swords energy very cold very distant very aloof this person don't show you too many emotions don't show you no emotions at all but this person wants to talk to you they got communication coming in this person wants to have a heart to heart this person wants to tell you something but it's something that they're quite an, an, a a little embarrassed over, okay? Mm -hmm, mm hmm Could have been uh something pertaining to money too. Mm -hmm, with this five of pentacles. This person might have lost money. This person might be doing bad when it comes to money. This person might be struggling with money or something like that. Something is not like it used to be. Okay. This person also may feel lost um without you or abandoned, you know from you or something like this like you're not giving them the attention that you used to give them or something like that you're not interested the way you used to be or something like that you're just not invested in this person this person is losing money and faking a funk like they got money or something like that yeah they're just des they're desperately trying to regain uh-huh so they could start all over again or something like that they want a new beginning they're def desperately trying to get their weight back up or something like that uh-huh mm-hmm yeah Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They want a new beginning with you too with this with this fool card here. They want a fresh start. Yeah, they want to throw caution to the wind and see where this takes them, honey. This might be something that you've been waiting for. You've been waiting a long time to hear something like this from this person. Okay, this person all of a sudden wants to treat you right, okay? Or out of the blue, this person is gonna come and tell you they want to do right by you. They want to treat you right. Um, this person wants to um or right some wrongs okay this is some truth that's going to be revealed okay you got some communication coming in again you got big time communication this is the ace of swords heart to heart conversation some truth is coming out okay yeah this person know they want to talk to you but they don't but we got the ace of swords it's like they're being forced to okay spirit is forcing them to open their mouth okay this person is going to have a lot to say okay they finally going to guard get a, get enough guts or garnish garnish up enough courage to say what's on their mind and whatever they're coming to tell you it's about a, a commitment or a relationship or a marriage that they're in okay either a commitment that they are in or marriage that they are in or a relationship that they're are in or something that they want with you okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. it looks like you're going to get back what you lost too virgo uh -huh. if you lost this person you're going to get them back if you lost money you're going to get that back whatever you lost you're going to get it back okay here's the thing i don't know if you want it back or you trust it to come back or something like that yeah it's like whoever hurt you whoever this person was that hurt you or broke your heart you're not so sure if you can forgive them you're not so so sure if you could forget get forget the situation or you know move on from this situation i see you totally investing in yourself right now okay you're your sole provider uh -huh. however you make money you know it's it's on a, on your accord it's on your account it's, how, it's whatever that you're doing okay whatever you do or whatever you're doing you know you're supporting yourself you're taking care of yourself and not only do i see it everyone else sees that you're doing very good for yourself you're in a really good place you're staying to yourself mm -hmm, mm -hmm. some of you may not like the place where you work though okay 
Mm -hmm. Many of you might be trying to start your own business and do your own thing, okay? Mm -hmm. This might be causing you too much. You like, you like the energy that you're in because you are financially secure. You're taking care of yourself. But the energy that you're in to make this money, you know, you feel trapped. You feel stuck. You feel unhappy. You feel like you can't breathe, like you're being watched or something like that, okay? Some of you are definitely thinking about relocating or changing jobs, okay? Some of you really don't like where you're at. And if you don't like where you're at, get the hell out. Out. Don't stay nowhere miserable. That's what that's what makes you old, ugly, stress you out, heart attack, cancer out. You know, lose hair, gain weight, lose weight. You know, skin start breaking out. That's that shit that start affecting your health. Okay, if you're not happy there, get far away from there. Many of you are business owners of your own. You're doing your own thing, or you have completely you know, left work and you're doing some kind of side hustle and you prefer that, okay? It's your job that you don't like and it's stressing you out big time, okay? If some of you want a job and some of you need a job. Some of you do not like where you work, okay? Let's pull some clarifiers and see what else we can get for Virgo. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Very good energy, Virgo. Very good energy. This person is trying to come back with you and wants to talk to you really bad. They want to see if it's okay to even talk to you on the same page that you want with day one or something like that. This is somebody who's not, they're not giving up, okay? This person wants to see exactly where this is going with you. This person wants to make sure that you, this is exactly what you want, okay? This person want to save face some kind of friendship that you guys had, okay? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Even if it, um, even if it's not romance, they'll take that. Okay. Even if it's not the, a romantic, uh, relationship, even if it's just friendship, they'll take that. This is just somebody who has to be in your energy. They have to be in your energy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is somebody who has to be in your energy. All right. Mm-hmm. They may come off a little standoffish at times, Virgo, where, you know, very wishy-washy, like one moment they want to be in your energy, the next minute they want, they act like they don't know you or something like that. Very wishy-washy energy. This person don't really know what they want. They're judging themselves, okay? Mm -hmm. Very indecisive energy. It says decisive, but but they, they're not making a decision, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's something that this person has to go through or are going through. This person wants a second chance. This person is going to have some sort of awakening or start seeing something through a different light or something. Yeah, they might have hit you with a tower moment too. This person might have, you know, oh God, this energy is just all over the place. This person might mm, be judging themselves because they broke your heart. Mm -hmm. um, you caught them cheating or something like that. Yeah, this person might have just up and left you or something like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, now this person is judging themselves. They don't like their energy. They don't like their behavior or something like that. Something that they did to you, okay? Careless with time. This person could have been very careless with your time. Careless with you. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Don't neglect your responsibilities. Might have been totally neglect they neglected you but they constantly say that they love you okay totally neglect you but constantly say they love you they come in they coming over they're gonna call you they love you but then it's the same old same old all over again oh yeah 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 this person don't know what they want very confused energy this person is really all over the place mm -hmm. a whole new world is coming in for you virgo you're not going to stick around and go through this anymore you got the star energy okay star quality okay wish fulfillment you holding on to hope even though you don't like the way it looks mm. a whole new world is coming for you and you still holding on to hope even though you don't like the way this energy looks okay you don't trust this person okay it's something about this energy you don't trust it's not secure enough it's not stable enough it's too wishy-washy okay this person is here today going tomorrow type energy okay uh -huh. even though they want to talk to you they want to have some some communication with you got communication coming in this person is coming to tell you something okay they're going to come and apologize or something like that this person values you yeah value you very much this person values value your opinion and everything the empress energy you're kind of like a star quality in this person's eyes they feel you get a lot of attention you garner a lot of attention with this star this empress and this world card there's something special about you okay virgo some of you are dealing with a gemini here uh-huh some of you are dealing with a strong aquarius a taurus <clears throat> 
a Libra. Uh huh. It's in the works. Okay. It has already begun. Nothing else to be done. What you want wants you. Okay. Mm -hmm. this, you know what? This this energy has been consistent like this for a week or two. Okay. Somebody's coming in from the past. Somebody definitely wants back in with you guys. Okay. Mm -hmm. And they're hoping and praying you want it too. Uh huh. Uh -huh. This is somebody that you might have a very strong bond, a strong connection to. This is somebody who just don't see your strength, or they will, okay? Maybe they don't see your strength, but they will, okay? Yeah, they see your strength. They know who you are because they see that Empress energy. They know how strong you are, okay? They know you're not a pushover, all right? You stand, you take care of yourself. You stand on your own two feet. But this person is still lacking something. Mm, they got the temperance. There's still some sort of lack somewhere. This person is still not giving you their all or they're not participating all the way in or something like that. It's like half ass. Yeah, it's like somebody else is still interfering somehow, okay? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this person could be in a marriage. This person could be in a commitment already. All right. This is what this person wants to talk about, okay? In just a few weeks, okay? Mm -hmm. The universe is supporting you. Network, meeting, socializing. Eventually, everything connects, okay? It looks like this is what this person wants to come talk about, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're manifesting this, okay? This is progress, okay? Mm -hmm. This is coming towards you. This is sudden energy, okay? New energy, too. The fool, okay? You got some sort of new beginnings, some new fresh starts coming in, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're going to throw, take a risk, throw some caution to the wind, and you're going to try it out. You're going to see where it goes for some of you. For some of you, you just don't trust this person. Mm -mm. You say, you bringing me what? You talking about what? You want to do what? <clears throat> Why should I believe you now? Why should I trust you now? Okay? We've, been, we've done this before. We've talked about this before. You made this clear before. And you went right back and did your same old shit. So some of you just don't trust this person. Some of you say, yeah, this is just what your mouth say for today. And then tomorrow is something totally different. Okay? Some of you are a little apprehensive with this person because you feel... It's just too much fuck shit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We also have bad gossip. People are gossiping behind your back. It would be wise to be careful with your actions right now. Bad reputation, enemy, bad talk. There's an enemy talking cash shit about you, uh, Virgo. All right. This is somebody who don't like you. All right. This is somebody that smiles in your face. Mm -hmm. But they really don't like you. Okay. They feel their life would be easier if they were you. This is somebody who's too busy trying to be you, Virgo. <clears throat> somebody feels they can be a better you, okay? Okay, we got the middle of the road. Careful not to get trapped between two extremes. Find the middle ground, extremes, compromise, and neutral, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Got the middle of the road. Lord, have mercy. Yeah, some of these people, you just have to leave them right where they're standing, okay? Because where they're going, you're not, all right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, we have superior, okay? Become a leader in the situation. Speak and act with authority. Set your boundaries and know your limits. The boss, leadership, authority. It's time to boss up, Virgo. It's time to boss up. This is your golden moment to do so, okay? A blessing is on its way. An important door is opening for you. That would make you very happy. Rare, once in a lifetime special. Look at that. Mm. Look at that. Spirit come through. And I have some more. Uh huh. Yeah, some of you really don't like this job that you're at. Mm -hmm. You don't like the fact that you're not working. It's starting to bother you. But, but the very thought of going back to your old job is stressing the fuck out you. Something like that, okay? Spirit has said that, that you're going to be on a path to plenty. There's going to be other opportunities. You don't have to go back to the same old fuck shit, okay? The mere thought of going back to work for some of you is stressing the fuck out of you. You don't like the toxicity. You don't like the energy. You don't like the frequency there. Something like that, okay? You will have no problem getting what you need in life you will be giving more than enough abundance luxury and comfort okay so you're going to be just fine some of you are really stressed out here especially when it comes to the matters of employment or making your money or something like that mm -hmm. yeah this is coming forth for you okay spirit wants you to pause and reflect be mindful of your self-talk and solve your problems with the fullest mental clarity. Get crystal clear on what you want here. Okay. 
Be crystal, crystal, crystal clear, okay? Some of you are dating somebody who don't really want a relationship or don't want the responsibility of a relationship. They may think they have to take care of you or something like that. You make sure you make it clear to them that you don't need them to take care of you. You can take care of yourself, okay? All right? We got hurtful events, okay? As you endure uh, this period, lean not to dwell on the past so it won't anchor you down disappointing heartbreak ah oh, yeah 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 some of you have been through a boatload of disappointment a boatload of heartbreak okay we also have alchemy okay the path you're on is about to go through a very powerful transformation transitions changing and shifts look at that mm, beautiful We also have judgment again, okay? It can be challenging when those around us are overly critical, uh, whether it is yourself or someone of great significance to you. We hope that this difficult period passes quickly and without too much distress, okay? Uh -huh. Somebody's judging you. Somebody's judging themselves, too. There's a lot of judging going on, okay? Some of you might be judging yourselves, all right? Okay? They aren't comfortable with who they are. Yeah. This is somebody that's imitating your vibe. Somebody wants to be like you or want to be you. Somebody doesn't think that they learned enough or they grew enough or something like that. Yeah. We have mental abuse. Okay? They gaslight you and or send you mixed messages. Okay? Abuse. All right? Yeah. Somebody takes advantage of, the, of your kindness. Somebody's definitely... Mind fucking you sometimes, okay? Be very selective of this person, all right? Mm -hmm. Lies, lies, lies. Artificial love. They don't really love you. Just stringing you along. Okay, many of you feel this way. Many of you believe that when it comes to this particular person, okay? That you're here for. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got trust issues when it comes to this person, okay? We also have divine vision. Get out of your own way. Discard the your projective outcomes and allow yourself to see beyond positive focus look deeper okay mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah watch that stinking thing and maybe this was this person's past energy maybe this is what they've done to you in the past and you're still there you know the lies and abuse this is why you don't trust them or something like that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah this person pretty much hurt themselves okay this person pretty much destroyed this themselves, okay? Oh, wow. <clears throat> yeah, they pretty much destroyed this one themselves. Mm hmm Spirit come through. Can I have some more, please? Can I please have some more messages for Virgo? So, Moon and Rising, may I please have some more? For Virgo, Sun, Moon and Rising. May I please have some more, please? Yeah, you got romance, Virgo. Somebody's definitely on your heels, okay? Somebody's definitely on your heels. All right, they're slow walking you. They're not really sure if this is what you want or if they should come with you with this notion of romance. They don't know if you're going to cuss some new name, slam the door, or if you're open for it, okay? Yeah, but somebody's definitely looking at you with their romantic eye, okay? Some of you are saving a great deal of money mm -hmm, for something particular. You've been saving your money, all right, holding back. Been doing a lot of soul searching, trying to find out who you are. Some of you are definitely don't want, want a different place in, on this journey, okay? This has taught you a lot of his matured you out. You're going through some sort of transformation, spiritual transformation. You're learning so much about who you are, okay? Uh -huh. You like this new energy that you're in. You're looking forward to your future, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. Definitely got some sort of victory coming in for you, Virgo. All right, you definitely got some sort of victory. You make you, you your your accomplishments are being made. Okay, you're definitely in the spotlight. You're getting that recognition. Look at that! Wow. Uh huh. Uh huh. You're gonna be having 
some invitations going out to save the date soon, okay? Might be some sort of graduation party, wedding party, bridal party or something, some kind of bridal shower or something. All right. Yeah, we got money, wealth, and inheritance. Okay. You're concentrating on your money. You're trying to earn more of it. Okay. You might be inheriting some money. We got inheritance. Wealth and inheritance. Okay. Somebody might be leaving you some money. All right. Mm -hmm. A relative might have left you some money. You might be getting something, hearing about a will, or somebody left you something. Oh, it's going to be an upheaval when it does. It's going to shock the nation. It's going to shock everybody. Lord have mercy. Walk in silence, Virgo. Don't tell nobody your business, okay? This might be a long-lost relative that you completely forgot about who always loved you and always said, I'm going to leave everything to you, and they did. Okay? It's going to... Mm. Heartbreak and suffering. Lord, it's going to upset some people. Okay? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because this is going to open up a lot of opportunities for you. A lot of open up, open up a lot of doors for you. Okay? How, no matter how this money is coming in for you. Okay? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Lord, come through spirit. What you got for Virgo? Mm-hmm. We got travel. Mm-hmm. Some of you are very adventurous. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You like to be in your car. You like to travel. If you're not even if you're not even traveling in the car, you like to sit in that car. You just like to. It's just you and your car. Something about you, that energy, that side of that car. Maybe it's a peaceful place for you. Peaceful living. Nobody get to bother you. No interruptions. You get to think. Okay, it's like the bathroom. <laughs> your car is like the bathroom. Can't nobody come bother you or something like that. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Yeah, you may like that place. That might be the place you go for refuge. Maybe to get away from the children. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All right. Spirit come through. Do we have time for one more? Yeah, we do got time for one more. I would say we do. Yeah. What other message do you have for Virgo? Spirit come through. For Virgo. Sun, moon, and rising. Yeah. Can I have some more messages for Virgo? Sun, moon, and rising. Yeah. May I please have some more messages for Virgo? Sun, moon, and rising. Watching you, mm. spying on you, being sneaky, trying to see if you're with somebody else. Mm. Somebody's really concerned about who you're seeing, Virgo. Somebody don't know what you're doing. Somebody don't know your business. Somebody's all in your world. This is a friend who wants to be friends with benefits. I really like you. Hopefully, this can turn into more. Uh huh. This is a friend who wants more with you, okay? This is somebody who wants to know what you're doing and who you do it with. Okay? This is somebody that you don't spend no time with or something like that. Possibly a businessman. This is somebody that's slow to commit. A boss will take care of you. Only once one woman attracted to you. Mm. Look at that. Okay, we got recharged emotionally or physically. Drain. Check out exhausted energy vampire. Okay, some of you need to recharge your battery. Some of you are really tired, wore out. You know, this has just took a lot out of you or something like that. Ay, 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 ay. Spirit come through. Okay, we got ignoring. Mm -hmm. Not understanding each other. Not getting along. Not talking. We have a new love, Virgo. An air sign, intelligent, communicators, smart, creative, generous, social thinkers. Some of you are dating a air sign. What's the air signs? Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Okay. Got a new love coming in, new interests. Okay. Mm. Okay. We got home body. Let me cook for you and give you a massage. Okay. Mm. Somebody likes to stay home, Virgo. Somebody wants to want you to stay home with them. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, somebody's very frustrated or something, uh-huh. We also have a snake in disguise, okay? An enemy as a friend or lover. Thief, someone acts like they care, but they don't. Somebody acts like they care, but they really don't, okay? Yeah. Somebody acts like they care, but they really don't, okay? We also have text message, okay? You are on my mind. I miss you, and I can't get enough of you, okay? Mm. <sighs> My goodness, you got somebody who's missing you, who wants you, who wants to come back, but you got trust issues. You feel they're a snake. You feel like they can't be trusted. <laughs> Listen to your intuition, Virgo, because there's a lot of mixed messages here. One moment they want to be with you, next minute they're running from you, okay? Next one minute they want to be with you, you know, next minute they want to apologize for something they said or did to you, okay? Mm -hmm. This was an ex-lover, okay? Mm -hmm. I want you back. I realize you're the only one for me. I don't want anyone else. This might be an ex-lover that's coming back for you, okay? Text message you, calling you, but some of you feel like a goddamn snake in disguise. You just don't trust them. Lord, Lee, Lord, Lee. Follow your intuition, Virgo. If this person don't feel right, they ain't right, okay? Keep it moving. Just because somebody wants you back, they don't. that does not mean they have to get you back, okay? Let me say that again. Just because somebody wants you back, that does not mean they get you back, okay? Be flattered. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That's nice. Oh, thank you. I'm flattered. But you can keep it moving, okay? You're not obligated to no one, okay? Already involved. Do not overstay your welcome. Run. Things will not change. Keep moving forward, okay? We'll only tell you what you want to hear, okay? Mm -hmm. This person's only going to tell you what you want to hear just to keep you, just to keep you interested, keep you wanting them, keeping, keeping you attached to them, okay? It's part of that mind fuckery. Be very careful, okay? And this is for the ex that's trying to come back, okay? This is for the one you already been through that shit with, okay? Uh-huh. Many of you are single, okay? Single. Mm -hmm. Looking hot as fire, okay? You might got fire in your chart, okay, Virgo? Beautiful, curvy, bold, go-getter, passionate, enthusiasm, courageous. Some of you might like the color red, okay? Uh-huh. You might garnish a lot of passion. You might be very attractive, all right? Mm -hmm. You might exude a lot of fat, uh, uh, a lot of passion. Okay, everybody wants to, you know, get a, have a part of you. Everybody wants to get next to you or something like that. Okay. Yeah, this is the energy that some of you might be in. Should I stay or should I leave? Should I stay or should I go? Time to make a decision. The ball is in your court. Uh huh. Very indecisive energy. You don't know what you want to do with this person. Many of you are well aware that this person is all over the place. This person may confuse you. Uh huh. Yeah. Very unsure, indecisive, and maybe. You you just maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Some of you are dating a show off, like the floss money, flex ego, cheapskate, tight with money, but they fr they front like they got it, or front like you know it's no big thing, but don't give up shit. Okay. All right. I hope you enjoyed my reading. I certainly enjoyed bringing it to you. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Talk to you soon. I shall.